all right yo what's going on guys welcome back to the channel today we're going to do something that's a little bit new today we're going to be doing a fight night event on ufc 2010 i can't do the career mode it's buggy in the emulator so i'm sorry for that um but again i think it's gonna be pretty cool to set up a couple of fights right now with eight of them i you will see them as they come up in each fight and i will of course keep uh, and let you guys know at the end of each round of these matchups uh, who I think had won each round or if it's really close. I don't think we're going to finish all eight in this one because it's going to be an incredibly long episode unless it's just chaotic and crazy, but I might make it a couple of parts as well. But either way, I hope you guys enjoy. Please let me know if you do. Let's jump right into it so again first as you can see we have vanderlei silva versus forrest griffin in a light heavyweight division this fight never really came about i wonder why that was to be honest i'm not gonna be controlling anybody i'm just starting the fight let's see who wins one of the best um one of the very best ufc games that I can uh, that I remember as a kid, I, I really really mi miss these types of games. So yeah. we might have to turn this down a little bit. I don't really want to get copyrighted. Uh, let's see. Just in case. Just in case. Now, something I really liked about what this game does is they say the whole names and something that, that nowadays doesn't do with, like, creative characters or anything. I don't know. It's pretty cool. I'm a big, I was a big fan of Forrest Griffin when I was coming up. Getting into the sport, I was, I was a big, big fan of uh, good old Forrest Griffin. We might have to uh, let's not do that. Uh, Vanderlei Silva was very, very good in Prime in uh, Pride. Pride, yeah, in Pride. Um, kind of passed his prime once he got to the UFC when all that finally, finally happened. Holy crap! Here we go, Vanderlei Silva, Forrest Griffin, touch gloves, here we go, oh boy, oh boy, big left hook there for Vanderlei, and he's going for an early takedown, a little bit of a curious situation, or a choice there to be honest. I don't think this fight's going to go three rounds. I believe I uh, the, even the main event is not five. It's three rounds, if, I, if I'm correct. Alrighty, trading. Big, big hooks between these two. Bit, another big left. That big hook. Missed there. Ooh, nice uppercut there for Forrest. Oh, and he gets reversed. Oh, boy. The ground upon in this game, I really, really appreciated for career mode. Really, really liked it. Ooh, nice getting back to half guard for Forrest and goes in for a Kimura. Catches the punch, goes in for a Kimura. Nope. Loses it. Trying to get him off, but it's a very open, open half guard here. <clears throat> Oh, and he reverses them as Vanderlei tries to go to Mao. Oh, goodness. Goes to, gets in his half guard. All right, all right. Vanderlei trying to push him off. Tried again and got him. That's some great strength there with his, uh, his, <laughs> his legs. His leg, really. Oh, nice dip in, in the left hook. Oh. Big right hook. In order to take down, and he gets it. Beautiful job, Forrest Griffin. Beautiful. Trying to pass his guard now. Oh, 
Open guard here. You try to close it there. Gets him off that guard. Out of that guard. Oh, and he drops him. Randall Lee drops him with a right hook. Ooh, another right hook attempt. Missed. <laughs> Superman punch for Forrest. Defends that takedown. Beautiful defense by Forrest. Oh, leaping left. Misses. Two really bad uppercuts there for Vanderlei. Misses terribly. Ooh, right. Oh, and Forrest drops him. 45 seconds to go in the first. Ooh. Again, they are swinging. Oh, big right. Ooh. These guys are absolutely throwing down. Ooh, big knee by Vanderlei with 10 seconds to go. Using that clinch to perfection. Good first round. Probably got to go Forrest there. I think the deciding factor is because they both dropped each other. Is just, I think Forrest did better on the ground when he got it down there. He did a little bit. He got him down, and he also was able to, to do some uh, nice ground and bound. I think that's the deciding factor in that first round. But again, I don't think this fight goes three rounds. If it does, congrats. Yeah, and a very nice Kimura attempt here for Forrest Griffin from the bottom. And gets a takedown. I think he got, what, two or three takedowns? Missed there with a big one. Drops Forrest with a left hook. Beautiful defense. Beautiful. Right back up for Forrest. Oh, it's a big, big drop for Vanderlei. When he really needed it as well. And then he got, I think Forrest got up and dropped him afterwards. Not right after, but. <laughs> Second round. All right. All right, all right. There we go. Round number two. Touch gloves. Good sportsman. Oh, both go for hooks. Man, that big left hook for Vanderlei. Cut over Vanderlei's uh, right eyebrow. Ooh, big elbow in close for Vanderlei. That was beautiful. Oh, another big elbow by Vanderlei. Oh, a big right hook. Big head kick. Okay, Vanderlei's coming on real strong early in the second round. Forrest looks to be just trying to slow him down a little bit. Make him work without getting caught with something big, big. Ooh, barely missed that that uppercut for Vanderlei. There's so much going on right now. Holy crap. Big leap and hook there for Forrest. Big, big elbow by Vanderlei. I, uh, they trade head kicks. Oh, my goodness. And Vanderlei gets reversed and Forrest ends up in mount. Oh, my goodness. Whoo. Open, open mount. Oh, Vanderlei closed it right as I said it. Trying to give up, give up his back there, but Forrest denied it. Again, denied it. Again, denied it. Oh, there he goes. Forrest has his back. Can he flatten him? Can he flatten him out? Nope. Vanderlei almost out, out the back. Now they're both standing. Good defense by Vanderlei. Didn't take too much damage there. In a really bad position, too. About 2.30 left of the second round. Ooh. Oh. Vanderlei catches him with that left. He caught him all fight with it. Ooh wee. Goodness. Caught him again and again and again with that left hook. Separates. Knew he'd stay there. Leaped in. Counter with a beautiful left hook. Vanderlei being Vanderlei. That was beautiful. Good work, Vanderlei Silva. After some adversity, too. Not like he was unscathed in that matchup. Beautiful work. Great job. 234, round number two. 
unfortunately, this game did not have what the judges scored the early, the uh, you know, other rounds. Once you, once you end it, you can't see what they were, what their scorecards were, which I kind of hated. I was really glad that Undisputed Three or the Undisputed Three had that feature. That was a really, really exciting fight. Coming up next, Tyson Griffin, Joe Lozon. Ooh, boy. Boy, oh, boy. Well, this one is a big one. I really, really like this fight. For people that don't remember, Tyson Griffin was... A decent fighter. Granted, this was ran into some hard times later in his career. Um, but this is a guy that knocked out a piece of crap, Hermes Franca, before we know he was a piece of crap. Uh, to, one of the only guys that was able to knock him out early in his career, and then he got you know, exactly what he deserved. So, again, that's me, Lozon, me, Griffin. Going in the middle, I'm not doing anything. I'm really curious to see if Joe Lozon can get this fight down to the ground. Very curious. Let's see. Let's see. Wow. You know how long ago this was. Lozon's almost 40. <clears throat> Here we go. Do they got touch gloves? Touch gloves. Good, good, good. Lowe's on coming out swinging already. Big body shot there for Tyson. Left hook for, for Tyson too. This game has Tyson a little thinner than he actually was in real life. Ooh, beautiful counter there for Lowe's on. Looping punches. Ooh, nice. Nice catch on the strike there for Lowe's on. Grappling situation, and this is where Lozon wants it. But beautiful job for Tyson Griffin getting him down to the ground. Even though Joe Lozon was very good on the ground, he did run into sometimes of getting he submitted. He reverses Tyson, getting his half guard. It's st it's still open too. Tries to close it to Tyson Griffin, and he pushes him off. Unbelievable. Goes in for a takedown. Does Joe Lozon can he get the single leg? He's no working for it on the against the cage. Nope. Nope. Can't do that. And he pulls guard. Let's see. Does he throw up a submission? No. He just tries to push him off. That doesn't make any sense. What are you doing, sir? You pulled him down. You pulled him down. You're pushing him off. Ooh, beautiful step in jab with the right hook. Joe Lozon. Oh my goodness. You don't go to the ground. What are you doing, sir? It's a beautiful. Big uppercut by Tyson Griffin. Push kick for Tyson Griffin as well. Oh, beautifully timed takedown for Joe Lozon. Can he do anything without Tyson pushing him off? No. Oh, okay, he blocks that one. It, it looked like he was deep. Okay. Uses it to pass his guard. That was beautiful work there by, by Joe Lozon. Beautiful work. And he gets out of it. Unbelievable scrambling ability by Tyson Griffin. Beautiful straight shot there for Griffin. It didn't deter Lozon, but oh my goodness, what another takedown. Getting Tyson to open up a little bit just to take him down. Can he do anything with it? I don't know. Under 130 left round number one. He gets the half guard. He's still trying to push him off. Joe, you got to go, buddy. He's going to push you off. You got to go. You got to go. Gets into mount for Joe Lozon. Beautiful job there for Joe. Tyson trying to get him out of that mount. This was back in a time where I really feel like those mount positions, people were just jumping, jumping onto mount. Sometimes nowadays you'll see people not necessarily go to the mount or just trying to go to the mount and then trying to get them to give up their back. Here they were kind of always trying to pop, get the mount, posture up, look for a ground and pound. Just to really lose it back in the day. Closes it up finally for Tyson Griffin. Oop, 10 seconds. Beautiful work. Good round. You gotta give that first round to Lozon. Even though Tyson had moments. He got dropped, he got taken down I think three times in that round. It's a tough round to give to Tyson, to be honest.
Beautiful takedown here for Tyson. Really didn't expect him to complete that. And then <laughs> Joe Lozon pulls him to go in, in guard just to push him off. And then here's the other. Here's the, uh, uh, yeah, the drop. I thought it was getting Tyson to open up just to take him down. It was a beautiful counter, man. Beautiful. Stepped in, dipped through that right, and caught him. It was beautiful. Okay. Round number two. Round number two. We got touch. Touch gloves. Good, good, good. Ooh, nice pep and jabs. Ooh, step back left for Joe. Nice clench there for Joe Lozon. Beautiful work there. And he pulls him down. Is he going to push him right out of his guard? Let's see. Oh, there's there's first attempt. Here's the second attempt, and he's successful. You pulled him on top just to get him off of you. Nice body shot there. Blocked, though, nicely by Tyson. Ooh, beautiful uppercut by Tyson Griffin. Beautiful. Stone leg kicks now without setting it up. Corey Anderson. No, no, no. Beautiful takedown there for Griffin. Body lock. Beautiful. Butterfly guard for, for Joe Luzon. Butterfly guard. And the ref's going to stand up. He's in his butterfly guard. Oh, my goodness. I understand they're not doing a whole lot, but let him work. Let him work. Oh, dip that uppercut again for Gr for Griffin. Good work there. Clinch for position for Lozon, and he pulls him down just to kick him off. Oh, my goodness. Can Griffin stop? Nope. Mm -mm, sure can. Unbelievable. Clinch for again for Lozon. Is again pulling back down? Yep, sure is. Back down in the guard. Is Joe going to do? Nope, just push him out again. Just push him out. Just about two minutes. Ooh, beautiful side, side control there for, for Tyson Griffin. <clears throat> Peppering shots for Griffin. <laughs> In that area. Not really posturing up. Back in the build up butterfly hooks for Lozon. Trying to push him out. Nope. Griffin denies that one. 120 left round number two. And the referee's going to come back over and. Nope. Okay. Okay. Oh, big head kick by Tyson Griffin. Beautiful body kick by Lo Lozon. Nope. Denies that one. Yep. You see the sprawl coming a mile away. Oh, step in jab by Griffin. Beautiful. Ooh, beautiful work by Lozon. Beautiful date down. Once again, getting him to open up. He only has 30 seconds to, to do something, though. This really seems like a Tyson Griffin round. Oh, oh clinch for Lozon. Tyson has got to get him to stop doing that. Is he going to get another take down? Oh, oh. Nope. Oh. Ended round number two. Woo. Beautiful work by that, that was a really good round for Tyson. Good good first round for Lozon. Pulls him in the guard, but you can't win a round by pulling guard if you're just pushing the guy off of you. I just think Tyson was a little bit more efficient. Did a little bit more of uh, that in that second round. This third round's gonna be real interesting. Touch gloves, beautiful work. Oh, nice. Step in hook there for Griffin. Beautiful left. Oh, clinch again. Nope, this time Griffin's not allowing that. Trying to get that a second underhook. And Joe Lozon pulls him in to his guard. Just to push him off. There's attempt number one. Successful attempt number two. Inside late kick with the body. Body kick by Lozon. Ooh, straight there for Griffin misses. Oh, there was so much going on. Not very accurate punches, but they're both throwing. Nice body shot there by Griffin. Another body shot. A big knee by Griffin. And he pulls him down in his guard again. 
Two attempt again. Two attempts again for Lozon. He gets him out of his guard. He pulls him in too. The body kicks are real nice by Joe. Oh, man. Big head kick. Probably 1-1 one, one going into that third. Missed with the body shot. Missed with the right hook. Big head kick. Beautiful head kick. Wow. Oh. Big head kick. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Beautiful head kick. Wow, big win. Big back and forth uh, fight by these guys. Not very accurate, but they were throwing down. You know, wow. I was very curious to see how the judges would score that fight. Very curious to see. Great job. Great job. And then the start of the second episode will be Ross Pearson versus Spencer Fisher. I think this is a really, really good spot to, to uh, make it a part one. If you guys enjoyed, please let me know down there in the comment section. This will be coming out here in about 10 minutes. As always, subscribe, like, comment, and let me know what you guys are thinking. Peace.